Okay. Where do we leave off? I don't know. It's kind of been a minute, hasn't it? Legitimately been a minute. Do you think we can fight Dan Duke yet? We should try and fight Dan Duke. Let's try and fight him. Maybe the conquest mod updated and I can fight him. Come on, Dan Dookie. I just want to fight you. That's why I've been waiting for all this time. Dan Dookius. This shit don't work. Jerry, if you could swap the positions of two countries, which would you swap? Countries? I really don't fucking care. Yeah, I don't think I have an answer. I really don't fucking care. <laughs> Two countries? South Korea and North Korea. Have fun, buddy. Okay. Back to what we were doing. Banished Baron and Colossal Carnage. I still don't think we can fight Colossal Carnage. Because we need Chlorophyte. Banished Baron spawned by using a mechanical... Lure. Lure. Or should I fight the caretaker? I should fight the caretaker first. Because I feel like Banish Baron might actually be hard. So be remote. Be remote. What happened? The fuck? Be remote. Six stingers. Any soul of flight. Well, I say any. Like, there's a different one boom be remote i'm ready let's get our potions and stuff get all them sippables but put them in the sipping jar whatever this is self-cooling pitcher is all i got we got a hot dog uh heart reach is always good put that in there that's about it. That's about it when it comes to there. What do I need? I need a regen? Uh, endurance. Life force. This one. Okay. And then let me get my summons right. I don't think I'm going to use this puncher, plant puncher summon anymore. Takes up a lot of space having that one out. So then let's do this. I need to also activate our trigrams. Because this thing is so lovely and it resets every time. That whole conquest mod, man. It's a cool mod, but. That should really just be reset in 24-7. I need like the most basic things that just give me like damage ups there you go can i get one more no okay so how many summons can we have i think it's seven yeah you know what that's fine five actually no give me one more of these guys okay never mind i guess not boom boom let's make it nighttime again even though i don't think it matters the night time okay let's do it mechanical b mechanical queen b that buff i don't know that buff i don't think i buffed there you go <laughs> 
Am I missing that much health or was that just me buffing that gave me that much health? I think it was me buffing. Wait, I didn't turn on my heart reach thing. I didn't turn that on. There we go. Now I'm actually broken. Actually broken now. Hold up, he dropping mods? I don't even know if I'm hitting it. With that hat. I, I don't know how to feel about that hat weapon. Might have to get rid of that. That was an easy buff. Up. I think we're at the point where we're... I think I talked about last year. We're at the point where we're so strong that like most boss fights should be like so easy to clear. What's up, Violets? Let's try one more. Oh! You keep it. What the hell? <laughs> I didn't know you keep it. I didn't know it was a good mod where you keep the item. Because mods don't do that. I'm still waiting for Vanilla Terrier to do it. Damn, damn. Where are my turrets? Oh, no, look at those there. Go ahead and hop out of that bubble. Oh, we got to kill the, the little miniatures. Never mind. Stay in that bubble there. I feel like my summon should be doing crazy damage. I'm not gonna lie to you. This dude said Arthorium Calamity or any other big content mods in this pack. I shouldn't even answer you. Just because you said big content mods and then you listed the most basic mods possible. We're real mod players out here in the Gamers 101 area. So none of those basic bitch ass mods are in here. My first modded playthrough mods. No, I'm playing. We just don't have those in here. But we do have a bunch of big ones in here. Outside of the basic Thorium and Calamity, we have a Homeward Journey here. Secrets of the Shadows. There's probably more, but slip in my mind. Spirit mod. And then we got a bunch of smaller content mods that make up for a bigger mod pack. Oh my god, I forgot about the FPS problem. I was enjoying the boss fight and then the FPS problem came back. I like how they place those bombs where you're like walking. Haven't we seen it in a use that attack already? The little like lightning attack. Did we fight this boss? I don't know. I don't think we fought this boss. But I've definitely seen that attack from a different enemy. Or boss. Okay. Well, my fucking throat is dry. <clears throat> Let me see. Let me cycle through the mods and see if I see a big mod. Like, these are all smaller. That's one more journey. We got Fargo's mod in here. Which, at this point, I guess you could consider a pretty decently sized content mod. Even outside of, like, Masochist mode. And Eternity mode. Cordy's mod. Decently sized mod. Seekers of Shadow. Spear mod. Spooky mod. Also. I think I would consider a pretty decently sized mod. Look, I knew I had a potion mod in here. I just haven't used it yet. But I'm pretty sure you can't even use these. Illuminite? Like, what the hell? What is the whole plight? Why is it even using a recipe? I didn't even know there's armor in the Verdant mod. It's kind of cool. Vitality mod, pretty decent sized content mod. That's it in terms of content. Okay, let's peep what we got. Cause we should have a bunch of goodies from this. Does this craft anything? 
Missile launch codes. Soul of Dight. Still my favorite soul name. Should I get rid of this hat? I'm gonna get rid of this hat. I don't want this hat. Let's move. Let's move this over. Can move everything over one. All right, what do we got? Is this Soul of Dite? Oh my God, <laughs> Soul of Dite, my favorite souls. And then we got Mechanical Wings, Lost Flight and Slow Fall. So this is it. Allow or press down to toggle hover, so I can hover. Press up to deactivate hover. Why deactivating even matter? What? Can't you just let go of space wire to deactivate hover? Maybe I have to double tap it? No? I don't see the point in having an up button to deactivate it if you could just let go and it deactivates. Hold up to boost faster. Hold down while not flying to fall faster. It's pretty cool. But I think I still like our previous wings better. This gives us defense, though. But I could, uh, what's it called? I could hover for a while with these. I feel like, I don't know, these are better. If I activate the hover on this, like, look at this. This is way better and it lasts way longer. <laughs> I just gotta make sure the bar doesn't drain, though. Because if it drains, then I take damage. Okay, let's see what we can make with Soul of Dite. Breach Cutter, sounds very cool. Before Shock, that's a big recipe. Um, Stuff Stuffer, I don't have a quad barrel. Swarm Grenade, that, that's probably pretty good, that Swarm Grenade. Taser Attachment, Summon Tag Enemies take continuous damage. Strange otherworldly remotes. Okay, so that's for boss later. Missile launch codes. I think we make like a gun here. If I just spread a bullets in burst of three, the first shot of the burst creates a massive shockwave. <laughs> Alright, what, what, what do y'all feel? What are y'all in chat feeling? Oh my god, there's still a soul we're missing. What is soul of tight? Like what? I got dyke. What is freight? And what is tight? Okay, I got freight. Then what the fuck is tight? <laughs> Dropped by the tightest of bosses. Alright, this is your choices. Breach cutter. Stuff stuffer. Swarm grenade. We can low-key potentially make them all. What's up, A-player? We could low-key make them all. Dite sounds like a made-up word. I'm about to Google. Definition of dite. Dite. Clothed or equipped. That's the adjective. Or as a verb, make ready for a use or purpose. Prepare. Let the meal be dighted. <laughs> that meal better be dighted when I get home. I'll be good, A player. Uh, 
Stuff stuffer? That's what we're making? What am I missing for the stuff stuffer? Illegal gun parts, quad rail shotgun. Easy. Easy. I could get that easy. Should I start making houses in like places? Do we have a second desert? We do have a second desert. Not that it matters. I'll just teleport everywhere, but I know we might as well make a little house out here. Just so I don't have to graveyard my whole home. And also, I don't want to put them in my arena to the right. How many houses have we made? Like, specifically, buying houses? Two. Not even, I don't even count the one at the ocean. The one at the ocean was an accident. Like, that one is just there. Didn't really make it on purpose. <laughs> but I'm making this just for my boy. He's a real one, you know. And who else am I putting out here? The nurse. Also a real one. For healing me. Actually, I don't even want to put the nurse out here. Well, it doesn't matter. I'm not really using the nurse. Dude, how did I put that out there? How did I put that block out there? Break it. I might have to put Lucy away. Well, Lucy still has 150% axe power. Lucy's pretty good. I think Relogic's gonna nerf Lucy. <laughs> could happen, right? It could happen. You guys remember the last time you used like the Reaver Shark in a playthrough? Cause I haven't used the Reaver Shark post nerf. No point to. It's a lot of effort to get an item that's not even that good. Kind of want like a genuine count of how many items Relogic has like nerfed into uselessness. It's got to be like a pretty decent amount. How, who the hell is this guy already moving in? Okay, who's the other people that could live with the arms dealer? Besides the nurse, like who else? Arms dealer Terraria. Why is this in Japanese? What the fuck? <laughs> Steampunker? Steampunker, welcome to the desert. A little bit like this. Boom. Switch it up. Now they're here. What's up, my boy? Daryl. Put a little pylon down, even though it doesn't really matter. Wait, make it nighttime again. Then give me these illegal gun parts. Give me about like five of them. It can be very useful. And then, what else do I need to do here? I need to... Music's bumping. I need to... Do something. What is it? Quad barrel. So I need a bunch of tombstones. Now the question is... Do I have a bunch of tombstones? Probably not, right? I... What? 15? That's the number that I'm looking for. Do I have a pile in here? I don't have a pile. Who's stuff with the stuff stuffer first? What's the next boss? The banished baron, probably. Banished baron stuffing party. What do I have to click? 
every time the play sees. You selling it? Thank you, sir, for your quad barrel. Come? What the fuck? I ain't making that. So I am not making that. No, sir. No, sir. All right. Stuff stuffer. Stuff stuffer. This thing better be amazing. Like, the damage, just looking at it, is not amazing. So this thing better make up for it somehow. It's better make up for it somehow. Stuff stuffer. Let's see it. In action. Oh, man. That's what it does? I'm actually impressed. I'm very impressed. So it's pretty much the... I don't even know the name of the gun. Whatever the Don't Starve gun's called. But then a shotgun. Actually amazing. That's got potential right there. That actually has got potential. Hold up. Put the credit card on. Murderous. Not enough. Need better. Sighted. I like sighted. We rock with sighted. Hello, I'm wearing this ghastly rosary. I should reforge this, huh? Even though our character is already pretty strong, you know, might as well. Might as well reforge. Give me an armored. Be a real one. Hook me up with an armored real quick. Potentially a warding if you're a real, real one. Oh, damn. You're a real, real one. What the... Everything but our Terror Spark boots got to reforge. Um, I don't even think the other options we could make. There was a grenade. There was the missile codes. I could make the missile codes. Oh, there was the breach cutter. We make the breach cutter. Actually, can I make the breach cutter? I don't have... I think I'm missing... Damn, I'm missing the space gun and the other thing. I can't even craft a space gun? That's cap. No way, I'm missing meteor. Look at that. Space gun. B gun. I don't have a B gun. I don't have a B gun and I don't have any bees to fight. It's palladium. The B nest. That's palladium. How come it didn't say it was palladium when I put my mouse over it? I don't know where anywhere Venuses are. What is that? What is the blue shit? En Enchanted granite chunk. Venus? Anywhere? Surprising, I only found one. Interesting, interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Uh, can I make an, uh, or can I buy an abomination? We'll just fight one like that. You, my man. Hans. 18 gold for an abomination. God damn. Let's do it. Only 4,000 health. So like that's kind of low, even for extra. Can't even see. Stuff her stockings. Or just stuff her? I don't know. I was thinking a stocking stuffer, but this weapon has nothing to do with stocking. Stuffers. Stockings. It has something to do with stuffing. The rapid small sting. I don't know what that uses. 
Uh, dark trauma. Do I open this or do I just craft it into a B gun? I think I just craft it into a B gun. Dodge all the bullshit. Don't really care about the 18 gold I spent to make it. I just want the B gun. I want what I came for. All right, breach cutter. Boom. Another new weapon has entered the fray. I'm getting rid of the maelstrom. Is this a weapon for something else? Holy hellstorm. Interesting. Oh, shoot. Okay. This is a mage weapon. All right. Let me fight a, let me fight a baron. A the baron. Oh, is that gold rabbit? Gold rabbit, come here. You use for anything? Gold delight? I'm good. I'm scared to fight this Baron boss because it is a Fargo's mod boss. Fargo's mod actually has a good handful of bosses now. Like outside of the hard difficulties. And this is one of them. I've never fought this one before. So I'm excited, but also terrified. So it could be a hard boss. But we're going to figure out who's harder. That boss or me. Let's find out. Got to make a lure. Not that one. This one. Mechanical lure. Enchanted Nightcrawler Armored Cave Fish. Oh, it's all sold by the squirrel. A shout out. Shout out. Uh, so they just fucking lying to my face? Is that what's going on? Do any of these look like night crawlers? Why is he selling terror spark boots? None of these look like night crawlers and none of these look like armored cave fish. That's all I'm saying. So now we just lie into motherfuckers. Okay. okay. It's fine. Now we just lie into motherfuckers, I guess, right? We just fucking lie now. We just lying. Straight up. No reason for it. Hey, where were some rocks at? Rocks. I'm out here catching fucking worms in hard mode. Imagine becoming this all powerful Terraria god and they got you catching worms in hard mode. And it's not for the Duke. I guess they have you do this a couple times, right? Catching worms, killing butterflies. So there's no other way for me to summon these things. They got me frolicking. I guess. I guess I got to get to frolicking in the fields. And then what was the other thing we need? Armored cave fish. Which I'm assuming we just catch at the cave level. I don't remember the last time I've caught an armored cave fish. So I'm just I'm just spitballing when it comes to catching it. Okay, toss those babies in there. Make us some night crawlers. Now, armored cave fish. I need some bait. Am I on the right thing? Yes, I am. Okay. Bait. Master bait. And then give me my fishing rod. Boom. Let's get it. 
teleport down to a cave. I can fish in. What looks good here? This would be a pretty thick cave. It's pretty thick, right? I have to, I have to connect this right here. Hopefully that's enough. I know how like fishing can be weird. Like if there's not enough surface level open. Like messes up the catch rate or something. <laughs> Who knows, but Well I do know, but I don't care. We'll catch it eventually. I got I got high faith. I got high faith like I'm playing Elden Ring or something. Hi, what's the luck one? Arcane. I don't think it's a light one. Luck one. Maybe it is. JR, would you rather have an extra ear or an extra eye? Probably eye. But what if I go blind in all three of my eyes? Then your eyes are kind of like just useless, right? Oh my god, we're full of storage again, bro. Are you kidding me? How many times have I dealt with full storage in here? <laughs> kind of crazy. Why? I want to know why things are in multiple stacks. Like, why, why does that happen so often? Things are in multiple stacks and it takes up so much extra space. Tell me why. Look how many things. Like, not much space I just cleared up. <laughs> Fixing this stupid shit. What are you selling? Selling a magic hat? Shoots random projectiles? Nerf blaster? Life stone? Kind of want this. I'm buying it. Cool idea. I just wanted to see what it looked like. Pretty sure there's a weapon we can make out of it. But yeah, uh, let's see here. What, what am I missing? Got swiftness, got iron skin, so I need regen. Endurance. Uh, wrath. Life force. Rage. Bohemus. My boy, Bohemus. Boom. Consumable. Throw while underwater at the ocean to lure out a shrouded creature. Consumable? What do you mean consumable? Why do you always spawn over here? Selling a whole hero armor set. You sent a whole pretty pink maid set. I'm buying it because you guys are going to want me to buy it anyway. So I'll buy it because we haven't had any new drip on our character. Since that bomber man fit. I also think it makes my character look pretty cute looking. Uh, heart reach. We're finding this thing at the ocean. So I'm going to need all my buffs over there. Let's just take a quick visit. What buffs do I have chilling over here? Absolutely nothing at all. Zero. Zero. So that means I need everything. Is it Peter? Are you the one selling? No. It's the jeweler. <laughs> Where's the jeweler? My boy. I'm going to need this. This. That's about it. Oh, actually, I need... Oh, my God. 59 gold for a heart statue? You charging, Peter. I ain't going to lie. You charging. I don't fuck with you. Soon to be banned from this area, Peter, for fucking upcharging. Oh boy, reselling, bro. That's crazy. The price was crazy. We got NPCs reselling to me. Let me finish this arena. Because obviously it's unfinished. And then upon doing this, I'm about to add another layer. He said, fucking scalper. That's what I'm saying. What a dickhead. Oh, 
Oh, was that actually a block? I couldn't tell if that was a block or if that was just like a piece of land sticking out. But like a background piece of the land. There you go. And then on top of all this, we're going to add uh, some platforms and shit. There's all this random shit there. We're going to add an extra layer of platforms. So give me the grand design and then give me the platform thing. And it's looking like there's a slight problem. We do not have that platform thing. Are you kidding me? Where have I put that? Where can I possibly put that? Is it in here? What? I stored the platform thing? How could I? This is something like I avidly use. I'm just storing that bitch. No way I thought to myself like, oh, I'm not going to make an arena again. What the fuck? I didn't even click. I was clicking on the other shit. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Wait, there's a bass statue here. There we go. That should be fine. A little bit more. We're going to place a bass statue over here. Heart lantern. Set up our contraption. We got no idea if this is going to be a easy or hard boss. Or in between. A little easy, a little hard. Let's find out. Send that baby on. And then what do I do? Throw while underwater at the ocean. Got it. Kind of cool. Kind of a cool idea. I can't move. Oh, I have to be in the ocean? Are you kidding me? Luckily, I could, like, move around decently down here. First, like, forced ocean fight. Did it despawn? Okay, I was about to say. Well, I lost like a majority of my health in like a second. What the fuck? Do you shoot nukes at me? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Y'all are gonna not see like a majority of this fight. But what can I do? I was not prepared for this. Of course the fuck you. Yeah. Fargo's mod boss does this. Hey, we're on the surface now. Are we allowing this? I feel like my heart reach should have reached those hearts right there. <laughs> what is going on, bro? This is not a boss I was exactly ready for. Oh, yeah. We eat those. I ain't trying to eat another one, though. Heart reach. Why are you not reaching those? I feel like that's really not that far away. That was a respectable attack. What the heck? Oh, my God. The lag. Come on. That's so annoying. I keep pressing the wrong button. Just hit him. Something. Summons. I got all these summons. Somebody hit him. <laughs> Jesus. That was a hard fight just because I had no idea what was going on. You tell me heart to reach. Can't reach these hearts. Dog, how close do I got to be? Fucking useless ass potion. They don't call them clutch raiders or nothing. That's what I'm saying. 
when it mattered, you know, I clutched up, beat the boss because I really didn't feel like fighting it again. Fuck that boss. I do want to fight it again though, cause I'll, I I got like 16 minutes. So actually, less than that. Good couple minutes though on some of my potions. But I don't think I can fight it again, cause the spawner is consumable. Who is anybody sell it? Oh, here. 26 gold to fight this dude again? Do it. I want to, but I'll do it. Sorry, it's going to be dark a majority of this boss fight again. Thank God that he at least gives you water breathing. Which I could appreciate. I like how that bomb bounced off the wall. That like heat seeking missile literally bounced off the wall. Alright, bring us above, bro. I know you want to do it. Bring us on up. Yes, sir. And he actually did it in my arena this time. Shout out, real one. Oh. God damn it. Still got hit. Dude, the lag is so annoying sometimes. Because it's like... I'll try and read an attack, but it gets so laggy that my movement from the read will be so behind. It's either so ahead or so behind. I'm gonna pop a potion. Get into that mode. Kind of a uh, dominant performance from Game Raiders this time around. Once he knows what the hell is going on in the fight, he kind of just taps into that mode. Was a close fight last time, but as soon as he knows what kind of bullshit is going on, he kind of becomes the greatest trivia player ever. Especially when it's readable projectiles and not just random projectile spam. What is that? Yeah, nice little hat. Alright, I guess while it's still nighttime, we fight Skeletron. It's time to fight the menace himself. Let's get it. I've been waiting on this fight. The couple times I've attempted to even look at Skeletron, this dude was kind of scary. Kind of did a lot of damage. But let's see. It's probably because our gear was just insanely bad at the time. But now our gear is insanely good. So it should be a whole new fight right here. Thing is, I don't really know what to even attack. Probably the hands, right? I'm just shooting, though. I I'm really not attacking a specific point. I'm just shooting. <laughs> Wait, hold up. Turn this thing on. We uh, got this on. Turn that baby on. I think I'm really liking the, the stuffer, though. The stuff stuffer. The DPS from it's got to be crazy. Like, those diamonds come out. DP has got to be crazy. What do I use when I'm out of mana? Just back to the stuffer. Should I use the bow? I should probably use this bow because I think I'm going to get rid of this thing soon. This bow has outlived its usefulness. Still a great weapon, don't get me wrong, but it's just, it's not on the level of all my other weapons. Is this Eternity? Hell no. I enjoy playing Terraria. I don't want to stress about every boss fight. I think I was arms. 
go into like that overdrive mode when their health gets low. Stuffer time. Oh, damn. Look at the point blank stuffer attack. If we shoot like five diamonds with the stuffer, the damage is crazy. And then we switch his bow and do like zero damage. <laughs> yeah, his bow, this bow is gone. I'm sorry, bow. What's it called? Bow of the wyverns. You've outlived your usefulness, man. Now, all my other weapons are just better. They're all like super good mechanically. Or they're just efficient. And the, the bow, I just I just can't see the efficiency. I just can't see the efficiency with the bow. I gotta maintain the arrows it uses too. Bow of Wyverns, thank you though. Thank you for your service. Can we get a thank you to your service for the bow of the Wyverns? Honestly has saved me against some boss fights. Respectable. Yeah, hold on. Make sure I get my inventories right here. Skeletron, we're probably going to fight one more time. Let's fight him again. Who's the automaton? What are you talking about? You talking about this motherfucker? very interesting message is randomly say who's the automaton kind of suspect message if we got any hell diver players in here kind of suspect for just stale to randomly talk about automatons almost as if he's working with the automatons Nah, I don't give a fuck. You know I don't be reading that chat in the bottom left. We got an automaton spy here. I'll be letting the super earth commanders know about this. So Deoxys. I'm not even looking at the fight. I'm just moving left, moving right, hoping I'm hitting something. We're going to be so broken, I'm telling y'all. We're going to get to a point where we're so broken that we might have to flip this bitch to master mode. But then Master Mode will ruin all the fun. So we're going to flip it right back. Yeah, get them, summies. I eat that laser. Get a stronger attack. We're just getting out of the mech boss phase. Can you believe that? <laughs> We've done like six hard mode streams and we're just getting out of the mech bosses. I did have to fight like an extra six of them, but it's still crazy. Oh my God, don't do that. You could attack me, you could kill my NPCs, but do not attack my FPS, you fucking demon. FPS is off limits. The last of the mech boss is dead. Just kidding. There's one more. But he's like... Well, I don't know. When do you fight him? When do you fight him? What the fuck? There's another mech boss. A mother brain. But that's a different one. You don't fight the other mech boss for a while. 
GR, I can summon destroyer at your home IRL. Is that a fucking threat? Get another poster to hang up. Wait, take one of these now. Why do I even have two twin posters? Wait, give me the skeleton poster. I thought these posters were used for crafting. I thought they were used for crafting weapons. I'm pretty sure they used to be used for crafting weapons. But now they're just decorations. You know what? This would fit for your decorations. Here you go, bro. You seem like the kind of guy that would have that. The decorations up here get a little boring. So I got y'all. I missed like a whole row of people. <laughs> my bad, my bad. Y'all will get yours next time. Don't worry, don't worry. I said, can I, not I can. Still a threat. Even saying those words to a tutorial player. Like, would it not be a threat, if, a threat if I went, can I blow up this bomb in your house? Can I shoot you in your leg? <laughs> can I bust in your face? Like, it's a threat. Put this away, put this away. I'm gonna pop this dice. Break this for bad luck as per usual. Okay. Let's pop open the goods. What do we got here? Precise mechanical spike. Six spike balls will orbit you, damaging enemies within reach. It's kinda cool. Destroys any projectile. Kind of annoying. <laughs> the way it looks is annoying. Could be pretty good though. The fact that it breaks projectiles. Like that's kind of solid. Breaking projectiles. Hold up. Can I do it? Oh, yeah. We are about to take flight, y'all. Oh, shoot. Tip Colony flying a straight line? I don't really care. I messed with it, but. There's gamers on one coming in. Any goodies that I can make now that we have Souls of Fright? Probably like everything, as we can see. Just getting your hands on Souls of Fright opens up every fucking recipe that exists. That mount reminds me of the Elden Ring mod with the fighter jet. Screw about Elden Ring. I'm playing fucking uh, Bloodborne right now for the first time. Finally, it's like the last Souls game I needed to play. I don't know how to feel about it, bro. I don't know how to feel about it. Like I think I like the movement and the combat of the game, but. You could tell that it's an old Souls game by some by how much of the bullshit that happens in it. It's really funny. Bloodborne has had like 80 situations where you pick up an item and then an enemy comes out from behind you, stabs you in your fucking back. It's not just like once or twice or a handful of times like Dark Souls 1 has. 
It's like damn near every other item. <laughs> You'll see a message on the floor be like, ambush, watch out, ambush, watch out, every other item. So I don't know how to feel about Bloodborne. I've one tried like almost every single boss. But like the areas in between the bosses, I have died so much on. Like I genuinely don't know how to feel about the game. Because Bloodborne, that's the game that motherfuckers are saying like this game is better than... This is the best Souls game before Elden Ring came out. But now that Elden Ring exists, it's like this game fucking nowhere near. Elden Ring level. Do you have any mod recommendations recommendations to do a to do a play multiplayer playthrough on besides Calamity? Like every single other mod that exists? It's so weird how people are so caught up in Calamity. Like, it still blows my mind. My whole, like, YouTube channel is dedicated to telling people about other mods. And I still get people always, like, asking about, like, is there any other mods to play besides Storium and Calamity? Uh, you could play Homeward Journey. I don't know how multiplayer compatible some of these mods are, though. Homeward Journey. Secrets of the Shadows. Modern Redemption, Starlight River, if you want like a burst of content that's not a lot of content, but very good content, shoot, just watch any video on my channel where I talk about like underrated mods, there's a lot of mods out there that aren't Calamity, I'm trying to decide what weapon I want to make here, these like, the Skeletron weapon sounds sick. <laughs> Someone's hands is a fight for me. What the fuck are these things? I want to make this <laughs> skull of steel. Do I have wire in here? Give me wire. Skull of steer. Steel. Did I say steer? This shit says awaken skull of steel like the motherfucker awoken his devil fruit. Yeah, Skeletron ain't awakening no damn devil fruit. Oh my god. This is amazing. Hold up. I got a whole other treasure bag I haven't even touched. Naval Rust Rifle. The Baron's Tusk. Rusted Oxygen Tank. Right click to disable. You count as wet outside water. Okay, so it's a nice little underwater thing. I actually could be useful when we go to the uh, Homeward Journey Abyss. And then, where are these other weapons? Well, it's kind of cool. I feel like it's a little, a little too much I gotta look at though. So I don't think I'm gonna use it. Oh my god, this shit is packed, bro. I gotta make a hollowed thing. Upgrade. Well, I can't make the hollowed upgrade. It's because I need the solar plight. Why is this solar plight in every single fucking thing I need? It's like required too. It's not even like a. Oh, you don't need this, but you can get your hands on it. No, it's required. Goddamn solar plight. Okay, hold up. Gotta reduce stacks. Still don't know why this even happened. Where like things are in multiple stacks. Multiple stacks to the same item. There ain't be, be no damn doubles in here of armor sets. You make me real mad. If I start seeing that. Don't need double of a mount. What am I going to do with two of one mount? Hey, how's this Baron's Tusk? 
amazing. I'm using it. Sorry, yo-yo. There's so much on my screen right now that, like, I don't know how long I'll use this accessory. <laughs> how do you get solar plate? Shit, your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> your guess is as good as mine. All right. So who's up next? Oh my God, there's still so many bosses. So many bosses. We can finally fight Colossal Carnage. What's it called? Shiny Bait. We should finally be able to get our hands on a Chlorophyte. Where is the jungle? In we go. Wait, I don't have a Drax. Out we go. Oh, oh my God. All right, we, we got to get these souls of plate, bro. If I already guess where we get these souls of plate from. is the secrets of the shadow boss, obviously. What's Chaos Bringer? Is it Vitality Mod? Is it, it's not the priestess rod. It has to be. No way it's the mother brain. Look how far that fight is. It's got to be the priestess rod then. Get this off my screen. How do I get this off my screen? Can soul of flight. Can soul of flight. I don't have any souls of flight. That's actually interesting. Bring in the wyverns. Bring in the wyverns. Soul of plight. Googling it. Okay, Soul of Plight is also in Thorium. Why is this in so many mods? This shit, uh, there were Souls of Plights in Tremor. <laughs> is this Secrets of the Shadow? What mod is this? What mod was it saying this from? Or was a homeward journey? To your shadow. Oh, okay. I'm looking at the wrong fucking boss then. I don't need to do this, but we might as well do it anyways for the future, right? I think Polaris is the boss we have to fight. It's got to be Polaris. So when do we fight Polaris? Oh my god, I don't see Polaris on here. <laughs> I'm not seeing Polaris. I, I had to do a pass it. Polaris. Oh, there it is. Okay. Activate frost artifact using key. Got it. It has to be this boss. It's got the soul, the colors of the souls of plight. It has to be that boss. Frost key. Need a frost core. Can I make a frost core? Or do I have to get one? Looks like I have to get one. Okay. Uh, there is one person we could attempt to talk to. Do you sell? Probably not, right? Wyvern. Clown. I don't think I've fought a snow golem. 
which means we probably won't be able to fight. Yeah. Oh, uh, let me talk to the abomination. What about you? Starts a windy day, starts the rain. We gotta start rain, right? Matsuri Lantern. Starts starts the rain. Hold up. I bet I could just make something that starts rain. That's like infinite. Amulet of rain. Oh my god, but it needs a fucking frost cord. What the hell? Rain charm. Way easier. Blizzard in a bottle and rain clouds. Rain charm. <laughs> yes, sir. You know, I can always count on that. Louis AFK reborn. All right, and then we're going to the snow biome. Where they at? Where the bad bitches at? My bad. Where the ice golems at? Chester, we're going to have to turn it up. We're going to have to turn this up. This music. For sure, pizza delivery, snowman. So this music for surely getting copyrighted. I feel it already. Deep in my bones. War, true. You are right. We're going to war, baby. Bad idea. Take it off. <laughs> Bad idea, take it off. Oh my fuck, these dudes hurt. You can count on Ice Golems hurting. I should go like a top five hardest hitting Terry enemy uh, short. Off the top of our heads without like Googling it. Because obviously I'll probably Google it for the short. Maybe I won't. We'll see. But like. Off the top of my brain, hardest hitting Terraria enemy It's the motherfucking master mode golem, bro. Rock golem. Oh my god, I can't move like at all. Off the top of my brain, if we're not counting no dungeon guardian. Because dungeon guardian considered more like a mini boss, honestly. More of like an event that happens <laughs> rather than an enemy. But like that fucking master mode rock golem. That dude throws one rock at you pre pre nerf before they nerfed it and fixed it. That motherfucker throws one rock at you. Boom. There goes all your health. That's like 501 hits. <laughs> Which always that always made me laugh. Cause it's like, what the hell? How did this slide through? That's how I can tell the devs weren't really playing master mode like that. There's no way. They tell you tell me they didn't run into that rock golem. I ran into that rock golem a lot when I played master mode. Damn near every time I was in the caves. You telling me they didn't run into that rock golem once and like, hold up, that motherfucker should not do that much damage. Like, I know it's master mode and everything hits hard, but that motherfucker is doing legit like 500 damage in one hit. Medusa? Yeah, I never see Medusa to even know how hard she hits. What was I making? I'm making a key. Should I make infinite potions? I feel like I should. We'll make infinite potions soon. 
we're at that point where there's no reason I should be buying them. But I am using this like pitcher right here. That makes it so like all my shit is uh you know way longer. Oh, I can put the consumables in there too. That's cool. It's kind of cool. I did not know that. Give me this extra self cooling pitcher. I'm gonna sell it. All right. Let's head over there. We have three sentries now. Let me reach out though before I do this. What'd y'all say? Y'all said Medusa Elements Awoken Magma Slam. Moon Lord Phantasma Laser. That's a boss. Boss attack. Uh, do I have all my summons? I have no idea. Whatever. You know what? Not whatever. Let's do it. Polaris. I don't think I've ever fought this boss before. Secret Shadow hard mode boss. Yeah. Don't think I've done it. What the fuck? That's a crazy attack. Not only was it impossible for me to dodge that attack because of how laggy it is. But like there's literally a million projectiles. Dude, my game is lagging so much. This is going to edge into that impossible territory. <laughs> I don't think I can beat that boss just because of how bad the frame rate is. I can't dodge at that frame rate. I cannot dodge at that frame rate. I, like, it's literally impossible. I have to turn into, like, fucking Yami Yugi and read the fucking future. I don't even know if that's a good analogy right there. I have not watched Yu-Gi-Oh since I was, like, 10 years old. I was just throwing out a random analogy. I had to turn into fucking Kira from Death Note. And read a fucking attack that I don't even know. <laughs> how, like, how do I fight that? I don't know. I can't fight that. I just got to get stronger. I don't think I can actually dodge that way, given the FPS, bro. The thing is, okay, the good thing is, oh, I didn't even buff, by the way. But the good thing is that the shit is not consumable. Which is very good. Okay, can we get rid of this little mini boss here so I can fight it in? Please. Please kill him. Running back. This time. Is this, is this on? This time. Actually, pop our potions. Let's get it. I'm using the wrong one. What the fuck? <laughs> so laggy. God damn it. What the fuck even happened, bro? Oh my god. This is insanity. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> what? I don't even know where my mouse is at. There it is. I found it. What the fuck? How am I supposed to dodge that? What the hell is this attack? <laughs> this is a crazy attack. He's got like hands spinning around. Oh my god, we almost beat him too. I think it's doable. It's just. We just can't get hit. We can't use our potion until that attack. But like, god damn, that shit is so laggy that I don't know, bro. 
That shit is so laggy. Dude got the dogma phase two attack, and I hate the dogma phase two attack. That might be one of the worst attacks in Binding of Isaac is that phase two dogma attack. It's doable. It's doable. We just need a little bit of oomph. You know what I'm saying? A little bit of oomph. We're going to get that oomph. Supersonic soul. That's what we're making. There's no mod that adds a shield upgrade. That's kind of insane. Shoot. If I played in the past with a big mod pack like this, it would be like 10 shield upgrades. 13 Shield of Cthulhu upgrades. Oh, you know what I can do? It's fucking life fruit and shit now. I can just like farm life fruit. But the thing is, that might take a while. Hold up. Do you think this pickaxe can mine chlorophyte? No. This Baron Tusk Sword's ass. I'm not saying it's better than that yo-yo, but maybe maybe it's worse than the yo-yo. Probably is worse than the yo-yo. That what yo-yo did like a whole 50 less damage. Yeah. yeah, I don't know if this is worth farming life fruit because this might take a while to even find life fruit. What kind of reason I don't really is that goldfish, like a literal goldfish. Yeah, there's a reason why I don't really be looking for life fruit that off. Or like right off the beginning of when they spawn. Doesn't exist. Damn, kill the fucking enemy. All right, this is what we're gonna do. Let's look at a bunch of our accessories and also look at new armor. I feel like our, our accessories are good. Ghastly Rosary. I don't know how to get any of this other stuff. <laughs> this shit needs ectoplasm. Items. Armor sets. Give it a second. Temporary freeze. Temporary freeze. Shit, maybe permanent freeze, not temporary. Will the game come back? There we go. So we got to find this armor set. Seraph. Well, the thing is, this shit or organizes armor sets by defense. Which, I mean, yeah, kind of makes sense. But the thing is, some armor sets you might just not get at certain times. Look, the Seraph armor set better. What armor set is this? <laughs> the fuck? Potman armor set. Where's the Seraph armor? No way it's that good. Look how low it is. That's past Chlorophyte. That's kind of crazy. I want that Potman set. <laughs> this Seraph armor set is like the best armor set we can find, bro. 21 defense? Holy shit. What is this armor set? I want this armor set. It's a minion armor set. How you get this? Plant chunk? What the fuck is that? Plant chunk. Do I have plant chunks? I 
have seven plat junk? <laughs> I want this armor set. <laughs> Alright. It's looking like there's not much we can do in terms of uh, making our character stronger. So, the pain. we're just going to have to rough it out. Just get to that one phase without having to use a potion. But the thing is, it's going to be hard to get to that one phase. Should I hold on to this? I should hold on to this. It's going to be hard to get to that one phase. Because the game is going to be operating at 0.5 FPS. But yeah, we could try, like one of you said, change the resolution. Where if I change the resolution? That's going to be worse. That's going to be even worse. I'm not going to be able to see anything. We are like 1280, 720. That's the furthest I can zoom out at 1280, 720. Why the game feel like it's running even worse at this frame rate? Like, it did not feel better. I need a food. Is anybody sell food? Wait, you know what I can make? It was a, it was like snake bite potion or something. Oh my god! <laughs> Unable to open magic storage UI. Panel height was too short. <laughs> Can't even open the UI. Does anybody sell food? Do we have a chef? Didn't we have a chef? Didn't Gordon Ramsay literally move into this bitch? He moved out. Are you kidding me? What a fucking fraud. You selling your food? What the hell are you even selling? Nobody here sells food? Okay, I guess I just gotta get this food. Okay, let's do it. Got high hopes. I can do it. The only problem is, like, what if? Whatever, it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Just use the stuffer the whole time. Dude, I cannot see at all. It's not helping. It's not helping. It's not helping. Go near the hearts. If anything, it's making the fight even harder because I can't see the boss. What is even hitting me? I don't, I don't even know what's hitting me. This is actually the dog's mo dog moves attack. <laughs> the fact that he does this so fast is crazy. Stop it. Oh my god, the FPS is gone, but we're winning. Oh my god. We did it. 1280 by 720. The cheat code.
see look it helped i don't even think it helped i think it's me learning that pattern of that second laser attack i learned the pattern of the second laser attack and then i hopped into the fucking our hover mode to dodge it But we done did it. And if he doesn't have the souls of plight that we're looking for, stream is fucking over. Oh my god, he's got the souls of plight. <laughs> stream would have just turned off. No words would have been said. The souls of plight do exist. Freeze your void meter. I already don't care. I think the void stuff is cool if I'm doing Seekers of Shadows only playthrough, but I could give two fucks in a big mod pack like this. I am not running no void. Wait, hold up. Place is down. I don't care how loud it is. Place this bitch down. I really like how you can just softly hear it. It's just annoying enough to drive you crazy. Just slightly just annoying enough to make you go insane. If you really just listen to that. Think. 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 Time to spend all the souls of play on hollowed upgrades absolutely not I'm using it to mine chlorophyte I'm not even using it to mine chlorophyte I did all that so I could mine chlorophyte come on one chlorophyte thing or actually I don't know how much chlor Wait, do I need chlorophyte bars chlorophyte bars so I need a lot of chlorophyte then I wanted to get this chlorophyte boom go fight that boss real quick, but I don't know how quickly oh shit there's a life right there. I don't know how quickly we'll get our hands on chlorophyte. Two whole bars. Is that a lot? Oh look, that's enough right there. Shoot, I lied. Boom. Chlorify bar. Yes, sir. Shiny bait. Yes, sir. Let's get it. Let's fight this boss. Notice how like 90% of Terraria fish bosses have like a gimmick to them. It's like fight it underwater. You're trapped in an arena when you fight it can't do this while you fight it get away from him oh my god what is that damage this is a dumb boss fight I can just tell off those first like two attacks I might have to go into hover mode My FPS. You know, it's a great boss fight when the first two projectiles that hit you do fucking 8,000 damage. Where, where's the FPS at? He's not spamming. There's no reason my FPS should be gone like that. What the fuck is going on in this bitch? How can I play the game like this? This is actually like starting to get insane, bro. <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> I beat all these bosses the first try. If my FPS wasn't negative. <laughs> 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 
what am I supposed to do? Did that consume it? No, the fuck not. That didn't just consume it. Why is it an actual bait? Yeah, that's not fucking happening. Give me 9,000 of those. <laughs> what mod is this from? Valhalla mod. Valhalla mod, get your shit together. The fuck is that? <laughs> Consumes the bait. Boss that spams projectiles that do 100 something, 200 damage a hit. The boss has figured out the meta. The only way to beat me, lag out my fucking game. Toggle frame skip, does that even help? Doesn't that just completely fuck the FPS over? Or something okay. What do you mean toggle frames? You mean toggle it off? Oh my god, this is even worse. You want me to play like this? Why is it so bad? Ugh. <laughs> This is so bad. <laughs> Literal fight in slow mo. Uh, I actually don't want to fight this boss again. Be honest with you. <laughs> he could uh, chill for a little bit. Chaos Bringer. Mod support dot boss checklist. Oh, okay, I got it. Now, how do you spawn this dude in? Totem of chaos, chaos dust. Totem of chaos. Hollow only at night. Hollow only at night. Got it. It's nighttime. What the fuck is shooting me? Honestly, this is looking kind of smooth. Smooth enough to play with. Like when I first toggled it, it felt slow. But once your brain gets used to it, it's like 30 FPS. Going from 60 FPS to 30 FPS. Once your brain gets used to it, it really is not that slow. <laughs> I'm in denial, man. Tricking myself. It might be working though. At first, you must trick the brain. I don't know, I don't got the rest of the quote. Trying to make up like a Yoda type of quote. At first, brain must be tricked. Somebody give me the rest of the quote. Y'all in chat got it. Look at the fucking dodging. I only got hit by like two attacks this whole fight. See you later, buddy. See you later, buddy. Kill him with the Baron Tusk. 
it, the game still feels so slow, and I don't, it's, I don't know if I can get past how slow it feels, bro. Insanely slow. Let's see. Maybe I can fight this guy, though. Come on. <laughs> Do I gotta actually put it in like my inventory? So you cannot fish with frame skip off. Hello? Is fish not biting today? A bad day or something? Fuck. <laughs> hey, what am I tweaking? The need to be day, I doubt it. so slow like even just trying to click colossal carnage I'm gonna dodge your projectiles this time buddy oh yeah this is like playing binding of Isaac on a shitty PC just easy dodges yeah good luck buddy Oh my god, it's so slow, but you gotta do what you gotta do. I just wanna knock this boss off the list so we can move on. I gotta find like a permanent fix to this. Because I don't wanna do this every time. I wanna fight the bosses at full time speed, obviously. I don't even know what just hit me. You spin out slimes. You are not the king slime, buddy. Find a new attack. This dude has 67 K health. Low key a lot. I still got hit. Bullshit attack. If it hits me in slow-mo, actual bullshit attack. Pull the hearts down. The hearts. I don't have heart reach. Now this is how Terraria was meant to be played, y'all. This is how the game was meant to be played. When Red Digit made the game, this is how he envisioned it. He told me. He said, I wanted it to run slow as possible. To really get the feel. I don't know what feel, but to really get that feeling that the game is 8-bit. <laughs> I wanted it to run at the same FPS that 8-bit games ran at. What's up? Heli, Heli XO Ox. Don't get hit. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. They hit me. Oh, shit. I got hit twice. Oh, shit. I got hit a third time. Oh, shit. I got hit four times. See, even in slow-mo, I can't dodge it. Just 
too too good of an ability. He's just beyond the levels that I would expect him to be. What the fuck? He has lasers? Okay, I might actually lose this fight now. Where the fuck did he get lasers? It's a 360 laser? Yeah, fuck that boss. We're not fighting that boss ever again. <laughs> That's a way too long to just get to a point where it was going to pull out a fucking laser. I sat all the way back. I said, okay, I'm going to just chill over here. The laser's not going to hit me. Now, this shit did a whole fucking 360 and hit me. Is this a good armor set? Minus 10 mana usage. This is, a, this is a full mana set. I don't really want that. I want a ranger set. If I'm going to use anything, it's got to be a ranger set. Provides immunity to chaos state. So you get teleport like an extra time. Bro, this shit is still full. I need a... This is fucking annoying. I gotta use one of my precious souls of plight to upgrade this. Heavy Chaos Claymore. That's alright. Demonic Chaos Mace. Low key potential. Might be better than the Baron's Tusk. But I think anything is better than the Baron's Tusk. For that Baron's Tusk being a. What's it called? Being a. What's it called? Masochist mode? <laughs> Not Masochist mode. Eternity. What the fuck is the name? Fargo's mod. Weapon. That shit is ass. <clears throat> I feel like we made like insane progress though even though we're playing at 2 FPS what do I have to do now it looks like I have to fight the old ones army which is my favorite event if you guys did not know Top three Turi event. Where's the Where's that bald bastard at? Is that him? What's up, bald bastard? Uh I'm gonna need what am I gonna need here? Is it fifteen defender medals to buy one of these? You gotta be jerking my dick. What the fuck? What is that? Okay, give me the previous ones, I guess. I don't know. Actually, fuck the previous ones. I'll just do it with the ballista rod, bitch. Just go like this. Boom, boom, boom. Already set up. Is that it? That's all I can summon three? And put another ballista rod over here. Ballista cane. If they get past, they fucking deserve it. They should get the win. If they get past that left side. Good for them. Yeah, get spawn camp, dickhead. Ow. What the hell? <laughs> That dude did like 40 damage. Generic old one's army enemy did a million damage to me. All right, there you go. That's set up. Like, that is perfection over there. Oh, shit. Hold up. 
forgot I'm supposed to click on that. Fucking creepers in Terraria. Yeah, I keep seeing enemies coming from behind me, so I hope they're not hitting the crystal. Wave complete. Yes, sir. That's easy. Put a ballista cane right there. And now we lock it down. Lock this baby down. Let's go. Next one. I, I missed the click. Yo, why why the, the hit noises keeping up with the beat? That shit was keeping up with the beat for a second. Just checking over here. Gonna throw a couple shots that direction. Yeah, that right side is really locked up. Like good luck. Good luck getting past it. Go ahead, start. Actually, don't start the next wave. Let me just pick up over here. Should add one more over there. Why not? How many waves does it go to? Seven? Damn creepers. Just quick check. I just want to see how far they're getting over here. Bro, they are not even leaving the portal. Hold up. It is fucking Gordon Ramsay coming back again when I don't need him. I should kick his ass out of here. He's trying to show up like after I needed him. He said, Oi. I don't know whatever the fucking British people say. Oi, Gordon Ramsay. Okay, there's wyverns now, so we gotta be a little bit uh cautious. A little bit cautious. Y'all y'all handling those wyverns over there, right? Okay. Oh shit. Oh shit. Not good. Oh, they're still good over there. We're fucking chilling right now. I got the first hit the thing has taken is from, guess what? Not an enemy from the old one's army event, but an enemy that just spawned in. Strolled into the fight. That is the first damage it has taken. You'll love to see it. Kind of tired of spam clicking, so I'm only using this weapon for the rest of the fight. Or weapons that I can hold left click with. Oh no, they're making it. Y'all were supposed to be my. Oh my god, this is so bad, bro. Back to slow mo gameplay. Y'all are supposed to be my lock over there. You guys are giving up hits on the fucking crystal. Shows you how like how slow and smooth the game is at the same time. Like it's an anomaly. How like smooth and laggy the game can be at the same time. Okay, more 
ballistas in the back. I'm gonna help y'all out. I'm gonna send these over there, and then I'm going back to this side. Oh shit, the ogre's here. Let's kill this dude, please. Quick kill, quick kill. Quick kill, quick kill. Quick, a little bit quicker. A little bit quicker. <laughs> a little bit quicker, please. That shit did not hit me. A little bit quicker, y'all. A little bit quicker. You're getting, you're getting a little close. Hey, can we defend the crystal? Dude, we have to kill another one? Keep that crystal defended, please. Let's focus on the ogre, please. I'm fucking summon staff attacking everything but the ogre. Y'all, come on, bro. Keep that crystal safe back there. I didn't put 80 ballistas for no reason. There you go. He's dead. Vent over. Crazy how I can stack one side with 30,000 turrets and still take damage on that side, right? Put every fucking turret in existence on that side. And still almost lost that side. We got some weapons though. Ghastly Glaive, everyone's favorite melee weapon. And the Huntress Buckle. Everyone's favorite summoner weapon. And of course, the Tome of Infinite Wisdom. Which ain't even a tome. So how the fuck does that work? <laughs> they just naming things. Whatever, it's fine. <clears throat> there it goes. Done, though. Now... Well, actually, now it's doable. I was going to say, now comes the impossible Betsy wave. But the, the Betsy one is doable. The one that is doable is Master Mode Betsy. Like, that shit is just pure insanity. All right. <clears throat> Let's finish this stream off by some gambling. Let's do some gambling. Plain, plain and simple, man. Plain and simple. Turn this shit off. Take that shit off. Because I literally can't see half the time. Let's do some gambling. Y'all have been sitting here long enough. It's time. What I need to pull up. This. Start prediction. Boom. Prediction is up. If you guys haven't gambled here before, we hit a golf ball. It lands in one of these colors. There's four colors. Yellow, there's only one flag. But if it lands in yellow twice, yellow wins. It's got to land in any other hole five times for that hole to win. So let's do it. Bets are in. Let me see the bets. Okay, we got six people voting. Two people chose yellow. I respect it. 
Because some people are so scared, they don't even bet yellow. Let's get it. Terrible first hit. Like, probably the worst hit I could have did. Let's get it. Blue starting it off hot. Now, blue has got those two flags right next to each other. But does that mean that blue can win? Nope. It's anybody's game, bro. That is the whole point of this. I've seen a lot of balls going to yellow. Okay, everybody's on the board. I've seen a lot of balls going to yellow ever since I made this uh, different layout. Like, I think we had like five yellows in total since this layout. Oh, my God. That was almost yellow right there. Okay. This is a solid game so far. Everybody is on the map or on the board. Oh, oh, oh. Damn. That looked like that was easy blue. But then the actuated blocks changed it up. So who's not even in the race anymore? Blue. Blue was the first one. And now it's not even on the board compared to the rest. What? I don't like that it does that sometimes. Oh, straight into green. Green can win right here. Green could win it all. Green. Yellow. Oh, my God. Yellow on the board just like that. Now yellow can win it all. Here it goes. There's the hit. Oh, red. Back on the board. So it's yellow, red, and green that could win it all. The other shit ain't even on the board. Blue's got one. Sorry. The 50% of money that's on blue. And there it is. Blue back in the game. Psych. They need to hit like three more. And there it is. Green. Straight sinker into green. That was a good matchup. Might have been one of our best golf matchups. Everybody was really right there in the race. The only one that wasn't there was uh, blue. All right, I'll let y'all decide. Do you guys want to run the golf back or do you guys want to do either the slot machine or the, uh, the NPCs? What was all that shit I just picked up? Speak about shit. Let's just deposit all this. Get it out of here. Need an answer. Anybody. Just one person. Golf. Slot machine. NPCs? Okay. See if I can find the fucking prediction for it. Boom. Which NPC will spawn from the statues? Self explanatory if you haven't seen this one before. I flip a lever, NPCs will spawn from these two statues. You vote whether it'll be modded NPCs or whether it'll be vanilla NPCs. Uh, the tip that I could give you is vanilla NPCs have won this. Damn near every time. Except for like maybe once. That is my tip. We're going to go to 11. So the first one to spawn 11 NPCs. That is the winner. Predictions are in. 
We got 90% of the money is on vanilla NPCs. While 13% of the money is on modded. Only three people voted. Here we go. Vanilla up two. Already. Modded on the board, but vanilla got another one. Modded on the board three to three now. Modded on the board and vanilla on the board. Okay, even matchup so far. Even matchup, bro. Oh my god, that's too modded right there. That's too modded. Modded can take off with the lead, and they do eight to six. And vanilla is right there. Modded had a chance, bro. Modded had a chance to just take off with the oh nine to nine. This is the decider. If it's too vanilla, vanilla takes it. That's an easy dub. If it's too modded, modded take it. If it's one one, then obviously we gotta do another round. But here it goes. For the win. Two vanilla NPCs. There it is. Vanilla, you win again. Congratulations, the two of you that voted vanilla. You get to split 112 Casimir coins. You guys get like 60 Casimir coins each. We need some more voters in here. Come on, we got 21 people in here. No Cas coin gambling. I'm offering you guys the chance of a lifetime to gamble. You gotta take the chance. You gotta gamble it all the way. Let me get rid of all these bubble weapons. Cause I'm not using them. Currently not using any bubble weapons. Gambling was always my favorite subject in school. Same. All right. And last but not least, we will do the slot machine. Will we hit a jackpot in 25 tries? Slot machine, very simple. If you haven't seen it, pull it. Boom. It's a slot machine. You know how slot machines work. Need new century. That isn't like a vanilla century. We have predictions up. Uh, we've been on a roll with the slot machine. We kind of been hitting the slot machine every single time. So that's my gambling tip to y'all. You guys needed a gambling tip. High percentage success rate as of recently. Okay, I like that the, the spear mods banners actually can hang on this. It doesn't blow in the wind though, like all the other banners. It's kind of weird looking. So I'm going to move it to go over here with these banners. Drop all the modded banners. The stiff ass modded banners. All right. Let me see the outcomes here. 9% of the money's on nah. Okay.
Where's your coins? So what was that, like 17 tries? Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. Got 22 coins. That's what happens and nobody votes, man. Can't do nothing about that. Okay, let me, let me look at our souls of plight here. Souls of plight, but not those souls of plight. The other ones. Some interesting uh, accessories. My mouse just won't scroll. Can you guys hear me scrolling? <laughs> just won't scroll. I gotta manually click. Storm Beacon. Mega Stone Cannon. That sounds like booty cheeks. This Pearlwood armor? What the hell? You need rainbow hair dye to make that armor? Very interesting recipe. They're all Heck. I feel like there are so many things locked behind Souls of Play. But like now actually sitting here looking at it is like nothing locked behind it. Give me the hollowed bars. Be easier to tell. We don't want to craft. I'm in the top 1% now. Largo, if I'm gonna be honest, you probably don't even touch top 10% of Casimir coin owners. All the people that have all the Casimir coins are not in the stream ever. Trying to make stuff from uh, the mech rework mod. Here we go. Prime rework. Some energy guns use no mana. Laser star. Melee attacks ignore 10 defense. Flux capacitor. That ain't all the weapons from that mod. I know there's more. Ain't there more? I'm not tweaking about the mech rework mod. Maybe the mech rework mod like doesn't actually use that many hollow bars. I keep thinking it does. Absolute alloy. Oh my god. Look at this armor set. This defense is insane. <laughs> yeah, hold up. Might be onto something stale with this armor set. That defense is insane. I feel like if I make this set, though, I'm not going to make another armor set. 24 defense, 16, 16. And it's a range set. Melee range combo. That's, I've been using range. You know, the rest of my weapons are mage. Absolute alloy. Can you craft that bitch? Fuck, we need to fight that boss then. We have to fight that boss. Because I can only make 30 of them. It's a curse. Curse and a blessing. We can just fight him in slow-mo. If we really want to fight him that badly. first I'm not gonna make a new weapon out of those bars if that's what you're trying to say fuck that 
Um, let's go to the rework mod though. I was not trying to make this scream matic horn. Yeah, wasn't I trying to make this thing? <laughs> Whatever happened to that? Something happened. Stuff stuffer. We got the stuff stuffer. Let's make... I, I kind of want to make this. Screamatic horn. Why is it everything I want to make a mage weapon? We need another pumatic horn. Which I don't know if I have two of them. No, I don't. <clears throat> we just used one for the stuff stuffer. Gordon Ramsay, do you sell like actual food, bro? No, why the fuck would he sell food, right? Why would he sell that? That doesn't make sense. Why would he sell that? <laughs> Why would Gordon Ramsay sell food? Tweaking off the perk. Just sit here and just take the shots. This dude's a fraud. Fraud. Come here, fraud. You're actually doing way more damage than he was earlier. See you later, fraud. You better drop this fucking horn. Oh my god, of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Want some goodies? There you go. You get some goodies. Okay. Let's go on the floor. You did less damage on the floor. <laughs> kind of crazy how much less damage he's doing. It's just non-apparent damage. But as soon as I hop on that platform, it's like a million damage. He's breaking me off my grappling hook. There's not a lot of attacks that do that. Dog lover's badge. The hell? What kind of dog is that? <laughs> what is that? I don't know. I'm a dog lover, but I don't know if I like that dog. Bro, are you kidding me? This little bastard doesn't chop the item. This dude spam dropping the houndiest shootiest. Have you been getting your funny up today? Come on. Of course. Can I just buy your treasure bag? Where's Carmen at? I don't know her name was Carmen. Vanilla treasure bags. Yeah, one deer clubs bag, please. Spent a lot of money on this shit. Scream Matic Horned. This thing better be amazing. What the? I was expecting screaming. It honestly doesn't look terrible though. But I was expecting the loudest possible screams possible. I say possible so many times. Weak scream. Demonic scream. That's what we want. Give me a boss to fight. Actually, I have a boss spawner. Imagine if it made the deer clop screen. That's what I was low-key hoping it would do. 
Because that would have been funny. Do I have a doll of flesh? Guess we're spending some money. I want to fight the wall of flesh. Because you never know when I need some wall of flesh gear. What is that thing? Omniscient Watcher. Come on, wall. Oh my god, this goes through walls? You got crowd control. I like how it gets bigger the further it travels. Pretty solid weaponry. You get an A plus for me. A plus for me. We literally kill a wall flush in the same exact spot. Use it on Polaris. Let me know if I want to fight Polaris. <laughs> Polaris, scary boss, it's scarier than the fucking other boss, whatever the hell it's called, scarier than the, uh, I don't even know what boss I'm trying to say, the squid. Squid is terrifying. Scariest boss in Terry history. Life Light? That's another Fargo's mode boss. Imperious. Dust King? Priestess Rod? Orombora? I'm actually excited to fight Orombora. Acidic Concoction. How do we make an Acidic Concoction? Maybe that's the last event I do before I end stream. Yo, eyeball dude, how do I make acid? How, how I make acid? That's not acid. Five of everything and then 10 purification powder and a bottle. You can't just bring your own bottle. Fucking lazy bastard. You know what, this is a good time to fix some stacks of stuff. Five, five. F Hello? Well, let me pick this up. Five. Wait, what, wasn't one of them like 15 or some shit? Was it Moongo? Does anybody remember? I already forgot. I need a bottle. It had to be Moongla. It was definitely Moongla. Okay, yeah, you're right. Purification powder. Hello. I got you. Get. Is that a water bottle or just a bottle? I got you. No, am I supposed to craft this? I'm supposed to craft it. Okay. May that potion faster than expected. I'll be holding on just for later. You say those are worth for your troubles. Next flash is similar, but my inability to move still prevents me from getting the ingredients. Okay, remember the recipe. Five shiver thorn, 12 mushrooms, 20 rotten chunk, 10 ice. Five shiver thorn.
12 mushrooms. And this is where y'all are going to have to come in and tell me everything else because I have no idea. I think like 10 ice. Dude, I hate how everything's in separate stacks. It really it was eating up my inventory space. 20 rotten chunks. There you go. Good shit, good shit. I actually have 20 round chunks. Times I need to turn on my oven. Boom. Got your concoction, buddy. 35 honey block, 35 pumpkins. Five sluggy, fifteen cobweb, thirty-five honey block, thirty-five pumpkins. Now the question is, do I have thirty-five honey blocks? Zilch, zero honey blocks. Uh, thirty-five honey blocks. 35 pumpkins. There's no way I have a single sluggy. Cobweb. Yo, wizard hat. Damn, big ass wizard hat. What is this? Why is this in separate stacks? 15 cobweb. Come, what? <laughs> How come one of those buckets made like a bunch, but then the other buckets were making one at a time? Just gonna have to do it the slow way. It's fine. Was it 35 honey blocks? Jesus. That's a lot of honey blocks. Like a different amount of honey blocks every time. Sounds crazy how it's like such a different amount every time. Sluggy will be hard if you can't buy them. Luggies is going to be the hard one. Watch this. I'll find it. 30 sluggies right now. I need to buy something. Though. Where's uh, Madame Zoologist at? Madame Zoologist. I'm looking for red hair. Need to talk to you. I need a certain item here. A very certain item. Here you go. Is this on? Okay, it's on. I need my nets. Where's my nets? Is that in my inventory? I put a net away. Oops. Time yourself if you can find five sluggies in five minutes. All right, wait, hold on. I gotta turn my oven on. I better not die while I'm gone.
Alright. I got my bitrate always says unstable on uh, Twitch now. I just save this event for next stream. What the fuck? Make it daytime. All right, buggy. I talk about the motherfucker from One Piece. Come on. Okay, grubbies. Can we turn grubbies into buggies? We'll find out later. Come on, grubby, sluggy. I mean, buggy. What am I looking for? Sluggy. What's the worst is when you break a whole thing and you don't find one. That's one. That's two. That's two. A regular worm. I don't need regular worms, to be honest. I catch the buggies just in case. You never know. Aren't sluggies like fairly normal to find? Isn't it the like the red one that's the hard one to find? Yeah, this one. Buggy. Sluggy and grubby easy to find. Buggy is the hard one. I'm definitely not talking about One Piece. Oh my fucking god, that hurt. Scream at him. Ho, bitch. Okay. I think our jungle is coming to an end in a second here. Keep me safe, y'all. My summon's just not attacking the enemy that's literally a foot away from me. Respectable. I don't know why y'all want to argue about dice in fucking chat. It's 50 50, bro. It lands on one number or lands on another number. Argument over. There ain't no science or nothing behind it. If there was science behind it, motherfuckers would be billionaires off of dice games. Everybody would. Alright, this is where finding Buggy and Dicky or where the fuck gets a little hard because we gotta find like flat areas with bushes you know what this is a flat area watch this we break it and then in the future even though it's not gonna matter in the future out motherfuckers will spawn there like a plantera thing genius right here too God, look at this. I'm a genius. For the future. This is going to be so helpful. And watch this. I'm going to be an even bigger genius. You ready? And I'm going to go like this. Be an even bigger genius. We're going to break all that. We're going to replace it. It's going to be beautiful later. Respect the vision. Okay, so can I turn sluggies or grubbies into sluggies? No. 
All good. So what was the strategy you guys were talking about? Should I just get like a... What is this? Should I just get a... Flower boots? Is that the strategy? I just keep breaking big bushes I find down here and just hope and pray. I don't think my prayers are going to get us that far. I think it might be flower boot time. I do why am I talking to this guy where's the other guy you you sell them brand new accessory I'm rocking new shit y'all never seen it before kind of a new brand Nike. That's the brand. Oh shit, look at that. I didn't even need the flower boots. Look at that. Okay, I just need a bottle and we're good, right? Boom. Gotcha, your mysterious flask. Good work. Heard that giant cotton swab can be used at shrine somewhere. Bro. I fought that boss. I think I can do that right now. Okay, recipe. Remember it. Five fire blossom. Five death wheat. Twelve rubies. Thirty-five ash. Death blossom. Fire blossom. Stop. Fire. Why are they in two different stacks? And why if I take from one stack, it takes from the other one? Make it make sense. 12 rubies. Yes. Thank you. Done. I just want to get this set up for next year. Keep talking to him first. Oh my god, get my mouse off of that. You're welcome. Uh, as a reward, you can have the magic pilot and the lousy teleport back here whenever you like. Eventually, I'll need you to bring me a special ingredient so I could cook a special concoction for you. One of each soul. One of each soul. Can I place this? Even though I can't use it because I don't have a regular pylon. One of each soul, but no soul of plight. Thank God. This should be the last one. And then we should have the concoction. I'll just bring it to him straight up. Yes, sir. Here, take this concoction with it. You should be able to break that giant egg over there. Yes, sir. There we go. All right, I'm going to stream here. Next stream, we're going to stream tomorrow. Probably, more than likely, yeah. Next stream, though, we're going to kick it off and do the little uh, egg event. And then on top of that, the uh, Ouroboro boss fight. But yeah. Thank y'all for coming to the stream. Made some great progress on the mod run. We'll continue that progress tomorrow around the same time, 5 p.m., 6 p.m. Whenever I awake from my deathly slumber and eat food after. See y'all.